Okay, folks, we got a 4.1 yesterday in Martinique, and over to the east a little bit, we had some five-pointers out in the North Mid-Atlantic Ridge. On the western coast of the Americas, uh, that subduction zone, which we've had our eye on for quite some time, we did have a 6.3 last night uh, near the coast of Peru and a couple of bigger earthquakes just to the south of that. In southeastern Australia and New Zealand, we have a bunch of different biological hazards from uh, blue-green algae in the water to a strange strain of bird flu, and we do have that cold wave moving uh, slightly west from India. Syrian protesters are holding a rally near the Russian embassy. Uh, this one is to protest all of the uh, ship full of ammo that the Russians just gave the regime there. Tehran is going to be using homemade fuel rods in a few months. I don't think this is very smart. They're one cruise missile away from having the entire Middle East polluted. Uh, for those of you interested in Gaia and this theory that all things are alive and interconnected, please go read this article below. It's a very, very good one. Uh, folks, I know a lot of you thought that we were crazy, uh, a lot of you said some pretty mean things, but the officials took two days, but now they agree, we may get a glancing blow from that CME. We uh, should at some point in the next 24 hours finally come out of the solar radiation storm. If you look just to the south of that so uh, big solar active region there, you can see another one beginning to coalesce uh, underneath it. And when we go and we have a little look at it uh, magnetically, you can see that uh, the region up top is fairly stable, but the one uh, that coalesced to the south of it is much more complex. Uh, it is morphing pretty quickly, and uh, if it morphs much more or gets any more complex, they may have to label this beta gamma. Uh, folks, we do have a, a strange looking uh, coronal hole structure that is going to be pointed at the Earth uh, in a little bit. We have this magnetic filament, which is hard to see right now because it's pointed right at us, but it actually just became unstable this morning. And the big thing to watch for today will be that lifting off the sun, especially because it's in an Earth-facing position. That's the news, folks. Be safe.